Okay, so this is a little bit random, but I'm on kind of like a solitary getaway for spring break. I've um, taken the weekend off away from work and school, and so I've just been inspired to make a lot of videos um, with my free time. So one video I've been wanting to make is kind of a review of this brand called Buddha Pants, and I came across them early on in the pandemic, um, you know, because they were marketing. I was working from home, I'm still working from home, and they were marketing themselves as, uh, you know, your, your most comfortable pants ever. And there was all these reviews of people saying how comfortable they were and how much they loved them and everything. And, you know, I'm working from home, I want to be comfortable. I also felt like shopping, <laughs> you know, like I think the shopping bug hit a lot of us. And so I went a little crazy um, on their website ordering some pants. and. Actually, I don't have those pants with me, but I have like four, uh, five items actually from them that I brought with me on this trip. And so I want to kind of um, give a review so you can get a, a feel from a real person because you know reviews can be fake sometimes. But I did want to say one thing. So I ended up buying, you know, um, I think I ordered a pair of their harem pants. So the, it's mostly like it looks like the company like maybe started out with harem pants and then has just kind of like evolved a little bit from their original harem pant into some different styles. Um, and then a few different things made out of kind of like the same cloths and patterns. Um, and they had a lot of different patterns and everything, but like I've mentioned several times, like I'm typically just like a black and white, you know, let me have items that will I can kind of mix and match with everything and just, I don't really want to like stand out with bright, wearing bright colors or anything like that. So. I think my first order, I opted just for some of the black harem pants, and I was just planning to wear them around the house, be comfortable in them, you know, whatever. Um, and then I think they also had the option for like a mystery pant, so it was offered at like a little bit of a lower price, and you would just put your size, and then you didn't know what pattern you would get, and I think they still do that. And so I was kind of like, I want to go down in my comfort zone, and I want to, you know, pick a pattern but I don't know which one to pick and so the mystery pant seemed like a good option for me to get just like a crazy pattern or whatever and they ended up sending me like a, a off-white color so I wasn't mad about it because you know like I said I like black and white and kind of neutral colors but at the same time I was kind of like ah, this is gonna be my chance to, to get out of my you know kind of boring um, you know standard stuff that I wear but you know whatever I was still, I was still happy with them um, and they were extremely comfortable especially like the first time you wear them before you wash them they are extremely extremely soft um, you know after you wash them clothes just tend to change a little bit but they're still really comfortable however I have not been wearing them <laughs> partially because of like the negative reaction that I got to them from the guy I was dating at the time. So I've come to believe that one of the best outfits to kind of deter men, so like if you want something to wear out that men will just kind of like be disgusted by and will leave you alone, could be harem pants because I've worn some pretty hideous things around this guy and like he was almost physically repulsed by the harem pants like he just hated them so much and he normally like does not really comment about my clothing choices so i mean you know maybe there's like some hippie guys out there that you know are really into girls in harem pants and clothes like this um but this guy's kind of like a gym bro so if you want to kind of repel the gym bros or whatever if that's what you're going for if you want to actively repel a certain type of man then this may be the pants for you uh so i don't actually have the harem pants i didn't bring those because again he was so turned off by them it kind of like changed my view of them and i hate to say that um but also like i don't feel like they looked as good on me as they did on some of the 
people that they had um, kind of modeling them on the website. Like a lot of the women, they do have different body shapes and stuff on the website, you know, but the ones that stuck out to me that I thought they looked like just really great. Like I thought the women looked so cool and like just, I don't know. I just, I thought they, they pulled it off really well and, and they looked really cool. And you know, most of these girls were like thinner, but then it, I don't think it was also that they were thin. I think they look better if you're wearing like a, um, like a sports bra or something that shows off your midriff. So you've got like your midriff showing and then the pants just kind of come up. Like, I feel like they look better, but I'm like, I don't like to wear like crop tops that much or, you know, shirts that show my stomach. And so I'm wearing them with like a t-shirt and it just, the figure I don't think shows very well um, when I'm wearing them. But, um, so that's just me with the harem pants. However, they recently came out with, and I, I hope they still have them, um, a version called the Miami Joggers. So with the harem pants, and I'll show you, I've got this onesie that I also got. Like I went kind of crazy on a shopping spree on the website one time, because I think I had like, they were doing like a, 30% off or something and so I felt like oh this is I need to get all this stuff now um, but this kind of onesie that I'm wearing it has kind of like the harrow pants um, harem pants feature um, on these uh, but I'm also going to show you some joggers that I got that I I really really like them um, I don't care if my roommate doesn't like them and he dislikes the joggers less than the harem pants um, he thinks the joggers are fine. Like he wouldn't have anything. He wouldn't probably even mention the joggers if I wouldn't have been like, hey, this is the same brand that the, that the harem pants are. Um, so I'm gonna show you those. I also, I mean, the pandemic's kind of over, but if you're someone wearing masks, um, the masks that I wore for most of the pandemic came from them. Um, they were made from like a soft, really soft cloth, the same cloth that, you know, they make their pants out of and the, the straps were really comfortable and so that was just kind of like my favorite mask to wear in the pandemic and I actually did get those they had like a variety pack that had a bunch of different patterns and stuff um, but I just brought the black one with me here like well I don't want to go too much into the pandemic stuff but it's my town hasn't really like had pandemic restrictions for a while um, but there's been a couple times that I've traveled and been kind of like caught off guard because I'm not used to the restrictions and people will want masks. Um, you know, they'll have signs on the board door asking you to wear masks. And so anytime I travel, I still um, bring a mask with me. So that's why I threw this one in my bag. And, um, and they also have bracelets and uh, bandanas. And I just happened to bring one of the bandanas with me. So <laughs> um, yeah, I guess I will just, I'll get to it and I'll show you some of the products I have and what I think about them. Okay, so this is the one piece from Buddha Pants and I don't think they have different like styles of it. I think that there's just, like they have different colors, um, different prints, um, but I think they just have it in this one kind of cut. And you can see here, this is what I'm talking about. Some of the pants though, like they have different styles where this kind of middle baggy part here goes even further down, like almost to your knees. And I think that would have an even larger um, repulsive effect on the men. So go for those ones that have kind of like the baggy, the baggier thing hanging down further. These, I think this looks fine. Like, I actually like how this looks. Um, let me just give you some specs so it's got like this little um, stretchy part at the bottom so you can kind of like pull it up a little bit make it make it even baggier for the men but um but yeah this one I'm not wearing a bra with it and I feel like I feel like I could like go and do things without wearing a bra like I don't feel like anything's gonna pop out it just it ties at the neck um, so yeah, I mean, I personally don't normally go out braless, but I feel like you would be safe if you wanted to. And my chest isn't, it's not massive, but it's also not super small. So even if you've got a little bit of a chest, like I feel like you'd still be, 
don't know how it's even holding them in. I think it kind of comes in on the sides. I don't know, but there's that. Or I've also seen in some of the photos, like girls will wear a sports bra underneath it or like a tank top. So there's that. So this is kind of the one piece. Really comfortable. I actually, I think I'm gonna start wearing it. I don't care what the men think, but let me real quick change into the joggers. Okay, so I just want to mention the sizes, actually, so you can get an idea. You know, everything is going to look a little bit different on everybody. But the one piece that I had on was a size small. And in general, I think most average size girls would probably fit a small. Um, yeah, so just to give you a reference, I'm currently 5'5 and about 155 pounds, probably somewhere between 150 and 160. Um, my weight tends to fluctuate like pretty wildly, um, just, I, I don't know, I, I feel like I'm kind of like a bear. In the winter time I kind of like put on weight <laughs> to stay warm or something and then it just seems like in the spring and summer the weight kind of comes off. So I kind of fluctuate between like, it's a very wide fluctuation between like 130 and like 160. <laughs> So, but yeah, right now I'm sitting at kind of the higher end of my weight and whenever I was thinner, um, I wore that and it fit fine and I still felt like that one piece um, fit fine today at kind of my, my bigger weight. But um, these are the Miami Joggers and I feel like I was a little, I ordered these later on, like a year or two after I, I had initially made my first order and I'm really into joggers and I'm trying to find like the perfect pair of joggers to wear every day and these are my top two. Um, so these are actually a size medium, I can't remember, I think they didn't have any smalls available but I really wanted them and so I ordered a medium and I actually kind of like how the medium fits, like they're really loose. Um, and just comfortable. Oh, and another feature I should mention is all of these pants are made pretty much to travel in, to travel with. So um, basically they have a pocket that has like a drawstring on it and you just basically like stuff the pants into the pocket. And then you've got the drawstring to carry them around in. So if you're traveling, like these are definitely a good pant as well. And, um, you know, they, they're they always kind of wrinkled. Like they're not made to be like not wrinkled. So, you know, they're they're really good to travel, to travel with. So I should add that as well, if you're someone who wants to travel um, and repulse men. But anyway, like I think, but out of all of them, like these are not that repulsive. Um, my mermaid didn't didn't mind these as much but yeah I just wanted to show you so this is kind of how it looks with the shirt on um, and this is just a standard t-shirt and it kind of like you know your figure can get hidden especially if you're wearing like looser shirts with these kind of baggy pants so if you want to hide your figure you know these are kind of a good thing um, so yeah but let me show you kind of with a sports bra on and you know so if you're doing yoga, I feel like you could do yoga in these or whatever. And so it's pretty good. And like I said, this is kind of how I've seen most of the girls in the site. <laughs> on the website, it looks like they're kind of wearing a midriff shirt and I think it looks really cute. Because I think it does, if you've got a figure, it kind of like allows you to see the figure a little bit more if you've got your midriff showing. If not, like your whole bottom end kind of gets swallowed in the pants. And like I said, these are not, these are not really harem pants. Um, so they're kind of cute. I've also got these in a size small, so I'll just show you the difference um, in the small and the medium. So yeah, the small is definitely a little bit tighter. I can feel like the waist on the, like this is still really loose. Like a lot of different body sizes can fit in these pants for sure. Um, but it does kind of like, I do feel it. I feel the actual waistband on this. Whereas the other ones, I don't really feel the waistband at all. And so I could even fold that one over and it's fine. But um, I mean, these definitely fit, but they're just a little bit tighter. So it does show like a little bit more of the 
figure just a little bit, but still like really loose and comfy. So I know sometimes I like to pull it, pull it up at the bottom. It's got the elastic at the bottom. Um, so yeah, these are the smalls. And yeah, these will probably fit better like when my weight starts coming off a little bit more, these will probably be more comfortable, but actually right now, just trying them both on, the mediums were super comfortable. So, next I'll show you the mask real quick and the headband, or head scarf. Okay, so I'm back in the one piece. I think I think that's the one I'm gonna go with for today, just cause it felt pretty, pretty cozy. Um, but yeah, like I said, they also have other products that are, you know, kind of like, the same fabric it's like anything they can think of to make out of the fabric that they make with the pants um they make it and it's kind of nice because um because they do that you have lots of accessories that will match um if you have the pattern pants and you don't just get the black ones like me um but if you do like patterns and you like some of these patterns they have accessories that will match those patterns made out of the same fabric and so i ordered um they had kind of some variety packs with uh, scarves and also have um, bracelet, like wrap bracelets. And so I ordered some of those and so I've got scarves that match the bracelets. And then if you had this pattern of pants, then you would have all three. And I think they may even have bags and things too. So um, yeah, so if you wanna kind of like match up things. So this is the scarf. Um, I honestly don't know exactly what size it is but it's a good enough size um i recently wore it on a cruise that i went on i wore it a couple of ways um in my hair so you can kind of like roll it up like this and kind of wear it as like a headband or you know kind of like a hairband around you can't really see it but like that um, I wore it like that one day and then this was just me I normally don't wear like crazy things in my hair or do anything but I'm like you know what I'm on a cruise nobody here really knows me I don't care what my roommate thinks about how I look and it was comfortable so um, yeah another way I wore it was like you know I had it like a headband and then I also wore it just kind of like this so also if you don't like wash your hair <laughs> and you want to cover up if your scalp is oily you could wear it like this and I like it even though I don't really like colors in my normal clothes I felt like this added a little bit of color to my outfit without it being like overpowering so I mean obviously you could also wear it like as a scarf or you know whatever so I liked these because they're pretty versatile and I've got I don't remember how many I have but this is one of my favorites um, and then the mask, if masking is still a thing when you watch this video, um, comfortable. Like I like the elastic, it's soft, it's got some, like a little slit in here if you wanted to add like, um, some filters and replace them, you can wash them in the, you know, laundry. I like the fit, so... Yeah, like I said, this is my go-to mask, and they also make masks in all the different patterns too, if they're still selling them. And then, I, I don't know, I haven't figured out the pattern of like when they send these, but I have a lot of these bags, like these little bags. So I think for almost any product that they send that's not like the pants, um, they send you, a, it comes in like a little pouch like this. Like I'm pretty sure, like every mask that I got had its own pouch and the pouch matched the pattern. So I have like a ton of these little pouches and I actually didn't mean to bring it, like I, this video is just so random because I just started realizing I brought so much of this brand on this trip with me, but you know, I kind of saved up these pouches and I just kind of use them to store things and I had, um, like some items in this pouch and I thought oh well let me show that because yeah like all of their masks I think came in a pouch and the bracelets I think they came in a pouch um I think they just give you free pouches like as a free gift so um so yeah um you'll likely end up with some sort of pouch as well whenever you place an order but 
yeah, I guess that's about it um, for the brand. I like it. They they are pretty pricey, but I think the, um, if I remember right, I honestly don't remember how much it was, but it's, it's good quality stuff. So um, I think it's probably worth the price. I think it'll last a long time. You can wear it um, for a long time. There was something else I was gonna, I was thinking I was gonna say, but I can't remember. But yeah, um, like I said, I, I would uh, I'd recommend this brand and um, yeah, I guess, <laughs> I guess that's it. I think I'm actually going to, oh, I think this is what I was gonna mention. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna start wearing them more. Oh, 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 this is what I was gonna mention. So like, why do I have so much of this here right now? So I was kind of stressed when I was packing because um, I had to finish up this big paper at work before I was gonna leave. And so I decided to pack the, the day before just because I was like, okay, I don't want packing to be in the back of my mind um, while I'm trying to finish up this paper. And then I, I left like right after work. And so I was a little bit, like while I was packing, I was feeling a little bit of stress and anxiety. And I was just kind of going through, I'm like, what am I gonna wear? I'm gonna be here by myself. So I'm not really, you know, this was just kind of a getaway to just like relax and like decompress and kind of get myself ramped up for the, the second half of the semester and all the work that I have to, have to finish up. Um, and so this was just supposed to be a really relaxing, cozy trip for me and so far it has been it's been really great um but i had that kind of mindset i was thinking about that like as i was packing and i was like you know what i don't want to overpack i i don't want to like stress you know have too much stuff and be overpacked and, and stressed by things um but i also want to make sure that i have things that i like and that i'm going to be comfortable in and so i don't know i was just kind of going through my closet and i saw these pants and i'm like you know what those pants are so comfortable and i've hesitated to wear them <laughs> because you know someone was turned off by them and i'm like but i like them and i want to wear them and you know this will be the best place for me to wear them and get comfortable in them because nobody's here I can just wear whatever I want and so um, that was why I packed that like because I just felt like if I'm gonna be I want to be as comfortable as possible and they really are some really comfortable clothes so um, so yeah <laughs> I'm going to try to stop being worried about what uh, other people may think about it and just wear whatever I want, but especially if you're gonna be alone, it's definitely a, um, a comfortable outfit. So if you've been kind of on the fence on, on getting them, um, I would say just do it. Um, I, I like them, so I guess that's it.